My real world collectors know why we shop for Pokemon at Dollar General on Saturdays, and if you don't know why, I'm gonna let you in on the secret. Hey guys, Jared here with Five Pack Magic. Welcome to the studio. And last Saturday, I was at my local Dollar General in Ware Mash, checking out to see if it got restocked. And as I'm walking down the aisle, I see a tin. So I checked the rest of the toy section with no luck. I then went to check behind the counter and saw booster packs and more of the tins. I grabbed a total of three tins at $9 each, totaling $27. But on Saturdays, when you have the app, you get $5 off a $25 purchase. These are the D22 tins. I couldn't find any information on these before recording, except I did a video on D21 tins that have the same artwork that included a Vivid Voltage Pack and a Darkness Ablaze. So here we are with these mystery tins. Let's dive in. First one up is Eevee. Same exact artwork as the D21, but if you look and see if I can actually get it on camera, it says D22 on it. Inside, we're gonna get the coin. We're gonna get our puzzle piece. And the two packs inside are going to be Rebel Clash and Fusion Strike. Now I'm strongly gonna assume that the rest are the same. Let's check it out. All right, so all three packs included Fusion Strike and Rebel Clash. Let's see how Dollar General did for hits for us. I'm gonna open up Rebel Clash first from the first 10. We get a black border card, so there is a good chance of a monster pull in this pack. Four to the front, and let's see how we do. We definitely all eyes on screen. We got something going on back there. Luxio, Durant, Time Pull, Volibee, Galarian Corsola, Toxel, Galarian Mr. Mime, Galarian Mr. Mime, and a Pinchurchin V. So big monster hit right there. Let's see how Fusion Strike does for us. White Border Card, Quick Ball, Sharpedo, Heliosk, Zigzagoon, Mankey, Clonkshire, Growlithe, Stuffle, Shelter, and a non hollow Zorora. We were kind of expecting that because of the white border card. So tin number two, let's see how it hits for us. The first tin gave us a V card and a non hollow. And a non hollow golem. Let's see how the Rebel Clash pack does for us. and a non-hollow Runarigus. So no monsters in tin number two. Let's see if tin number three can be a little bit more lucky. Agla Slash. All right, last pack. And if you haven't done it yet, hit that like button for me. Tell YouTube I make some super cool stuff. Let's see if we get lucky in the final pack. And it's a white border card. All right, guys, so that means we're not gonna get anything in this last pack, but let's play some Guess the Energy and have some fun. I'm gonna go with uh, Fire Energy. Ah, uh, Fighting Energy. Guys, I really appreciate you hanging out with me, checking this out. So this was $3 General Tins. Let me know down in the comments what you think, as we will probably get a non-hollow hit here. Let's see, the reverse and a non-hollow hit. So unfortunately, these were a pretty big miss in my opinion, but still a lot of fun, guys. Dollar Generals, $5 off on Saturdays of a $25 purchase or more. Real World Collectors, let's go get it.